You might be using rank tracking software that can tell you if your important search queries are returning features like AI overviews, featured snippets, or people also ask features in search engines results pages. But how can you find out what those visitors do if they end up clicking through to your website? Let's set that up. The key to tracking these results is how that URL is formatted. For example, here's a link to a featured snippet on our website. I searched for how to track URLs with hashtags, and here's the URL that comes up in the sidebar of the AI overview result. That hashtag colon tilde colon text equals part is the key here. When you click through, you've probably seen that the visitor is taken right to that part of the page and the text is highlighted. You might think that if you follow our posts on how to track URLs that have a hashtag that you'd be able to track this, but unfortunately we need to do a bit more work before we can track it in GA4. This does require the use of Google Tag Manager, but I'll walk you through the whole process step by step. This technique was first published by Brody Clerk, and I've used his code as a base, but I've added an improvement. The text in the URL actually denotes the start and the end of the highlight, and we can save this whole text in a single event parameter in GA4, but I was finding it was getting cut off if longer words are getting highlighted, since GA4 has a hard limit of 100 characters in their event parameters. So what I've done is I've separated out the first part of the highlight and the end part of the highlight, and we'll save those as separate pieces of information in GA4, which will make it easier for your reporting. Now, an important caveat before we get started. There is no difference in the URL that visitors who click on an AI overview or a featured snippet or a people also ask feature. They all show up the same. Also, not all links from these search features include that fancy URL, so you won't be able to track this 100% of the time. Now, what can you do with this? Once you've collected some data, you can create a report or exploration in GA4 looking at landing pages in the snippet text, or use Looker Studio to blend this data together with the information you get from your rank tracking software. That will tell you not only what pages of your site are coming up and what the search term was, but now you can combine that with visitor metrics, such as if they were engaged, did they actually consume your content, or did they convert? This way you're getting more of an understanding of not only behavior on the search engine side of things, but also what these visitors do if they do actually click through to your website.